Wait a minute. Didn't I just get a package like this a couple of months ago and install this on my bike? I did install this on my bike, so why do I have another one? Well, you see, I was wondering why my right leg was getting hot and I couldn't figure it out. So there actually is a problem, but it was solved. You see this? This is where, if you remember in the video, and I will put the video link above when I replace this, this is where the heat shield goes and the heat shield is missing. So let's talk about it. All right, so right here is where the bracket was welded that held on the heat shield. All right, from there to there, and it kept the heat shield in place. Now, there's a problem with this, and I have to give really good props to QD and to Bellissimoto because they handled it like pros. So apparently there was a small batch where there was some weld issues with this bracket right here. And as soon as I called Bellissimoto and sent them a, 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 an email, and I was like, hey, having an issue, sent them the photo. They immediately put me in direct contact with QD, hard to see them behind this right here. And QD immediately said, yep, we know that there's a small batch, there's a couple of these that have happened to, you just happen to have one of them. And they immediately directed uh, Bellissimoto to send me a brand new one, which they did, which I'm going to go and unbox, put the new one on. This is literally a five minute job. And since this bracket was already changed, it's probably more like a three or four minute job. So this is super simple, but I can tell you that I am extremely pleased, extremely happy with the customer service of Bellissimoto out there in Las Vegas and with QD exhaust. First of all, I love the look. I love the way it sounds, and of course, this is a problem, but things happen and they're really taking care of it. So I can't say enough about QD exhaust and about Bellissimoto taking care of this problem. So let's go unbox it. Okay, so the first problem I'm gonna have is I have to go find a dull blade because apparently I'm not supposed to open this with a sharp blade. So let me go through my drawers and see if I can find maybe an older blade that's a little dull, that might help. All right, so I used the dullest blade I can find. Let's pop this open and let's see. I already was in here so I can do this with one hand. And we have some packing material and of course we have the unit itself. It's just amazing on how lightweight this actually is. I might have to, hold on. Let me put this on uh, <laughs> 0.5 so we have some more. But it's amazing how light this is. And I have to tell you that I made a mistake last time because they asked me for my warranty card. And I was like, uh, maybe you sent it to me, but I don't remember keeping it. I had all of these Bellissimoto stickers, but I'm like, why don't I have it? And I look in here and I'm like, they still didn't give it to me. And then I'm over here and I'm like, I don't see it. And then I do this and notice that taped to the inside of the box, which is what I missed last time, completely missed because of the way I opened it is the actual warranty card. So when you get something from a QD, make sure that you check the inside of the box because I missed this last time and it's exactly why I didn't have it. All right, so this is an Italian, and basically what it says is, Dear customer, thank you for choosing our products. Please remember to register your service card on our website. Log into the reserved area on the following link at service card. Okay, if you are not registered. All right, so that is pretty simple directions, and here's the card that I was supposed to have that I didn't have. Um, again, if you get a QD product, make sure you check and you keep this so you don't lose it. All right, so when I unpackage it, here is the QD exhaust. It is so lightweight. Beforehand, we're gonna go ahead and take out this little baffle on the inside. We'll show you how to do that. And there are the brand new welds that to me look, well, uh, if it'll focus, 
a lot better than the last ones. Okay, so I think we should be in good shape. This is everything you need. And again, this is literally like a five minute job, but I'm gonna make this about a 10 minute video. All right, so on this carbon fiber cap, there are three Phillips head screws. One, two, and three. We're gonna take these off, um, take them out, take this off, and you're gonna see how easy it is to remove this baffle. And trust me when I tell you, you absolutely positively want to take this cover on and off, off and put it back on while this is off the bike because there's always going to be the one screw on the other side that's really difficult to get to. You're going to be using a stubby screwdriver and it's a pain in the butt to get it screwed back in there. The next thing is going to be a number four millimeter hex head and you will have four screws to remove right there. So once those screws are out, you simply just lift this cover right off, place it neatly down, and then you can access this sound attenuating baffle, which literally removes this easy. I mean, it just pulls it. Hey, I caught that. You pull it right off and then you can see inside. Let's see if we can get better lighting this way. You can see inside there and of course, you can't see light all the way through. Oh, actually you can. See that? You can see all the way through. So just put the cover back on, put the lid back on, and you could put it on the bike. And again, there's gonna be a link right up there on how I changed this the first time. Okay, so let's take the old one off, put the new one on, and let's see what it looks like with the heat shield. So there you go, all done. And the most important part, which is the entire reason when I realized why is my right leg getting so hot? And that's the reason right there. It's amazing just how effective that piece is to deflect the heat. I have zero issues when it's in place and apparently when it was missing, I was like, why is my leg so hot? I never heard it fall off. I didn't know it fell off. But with the carbon fiber piece on there and the new weld and a new piece from QD, thank you QD and thank you Bellissimoto in Las Vegas. I appreciate it. This job is done, complete, and I will be sending back the old one as promised. This is Rainbow. Please like, please subscribe. Thank you and have a great day.